girl shit. I still running through the mall with your motherfucking daddy. Aquarius, me. I'm a hot girl, I don't do titles. If I do, they it'll be Michael. He's just spicy, tipping tiny. Yellow bone chick look like hey Donnie. Freaking the sheets, freak on the beast. Niggas been hooked since big old freak. I realized that I was a shit when RP niggas wanna start rap beat. These niggas ain't got no name. Happy New Year's Eve morning, baby. We up. I'm on my way to the gym. Okay, you guys. So I'm at Planet Fitness. Yeah. I'm about to do this vibe. So I'm about to wipe off my mat. Uh oh, babe. I'm sorry. I'm in your way. Okay. Happy New Year. So I'm gonna wipe off this mat. I'm gonna clean off this mat and work on these legs. I think every day should be a leg day. The older I get, the more cellulite I get. The weaker my legs get. So um, I'm gonna start with legs. So let's get it. So okay guys, I'm about to get on get on. This man look like he got a hole. This man look like he got a this man got a possum. Let me show y'all this man got a possum on the back of his girl. This the country girl. This man got a possum on the back of his car. Let me show you. How you two? Come here. Hey y'all, I thought he had a possum on his uh on his um back of his car. What do you got, babe? That's the biggest possum ever. Right, because I was in my car, I didn't see it, but what you got? That's a big old doe. This a deer? Yep. Look, y'all. Yeah. Female deer. Doe deer, female deer. So you eat deer? You eating this for That's gonna... about all the meat I eat. Oh, it's deer? Yep. How long you been eating it? That's... Come here. Yes, deer. I'm scared. How long you been eating it? Oh, I've been eating it for decades. Did? But, so you uh, catch them yourself? Yep. Go out and get them myself. And but you have to shoot up. it? Yeah. With and a, clean it. Shoot it with a real gun or like a dart? I use a gun and I also use a, a crossbow. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. The boy arrow? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So where you is it like behind your house? Is it maybe behind your house or you go hunting? Oh, it's behind. Well, I live on 34 acres. Oh, so dude. I go behind behind the, the house. And you cut it and clean it? Yep. How long that take? Oh, that takes about 15 minutes. Then I got to take for the, real? Take it to the processor 10 minutes from here. And oh, and they do something for they'll you? They'll cut it up into steaks and grind it up and make burgers. So you finna eat this one for New Year's Eve? For New Year's? Oh, that's that's about, that'll give me about 40 pounds. So you're going to eat that for a while, huh? Yeah, well, I got about three other ones, so. Wow. Of about uh, 160 pounds. Who taught freezer. you how to do this? Just learn yourself. Did? How long you been doing it? 40 years. Wow. So you don't eat chicken then? Oh, I eat chicken. I, I eat geese, ducks, wow. dogs. Basically, try and shoot everything. So you, so you re it's really healthy because this is fresh. Yes, no hormones. You know exactly yes. where it's coming from. That all that cancer stuff they putting yep, all up in there. It's that. low fat, and I'm also a farmer, so I grow almost all my own vegetables too. Yeah, let me get some vegetables from you because I've just been on a raw fruit and vegetable diet, and I can buy my fruit and. I just went through a deep freeze. I lost everything. Well, I'm gonna get your number, and then when things get back better, maybe next year, okay, I could just be getting it from you Sounds instead good. of going through the stores and it be all processed and stuff. Yeah, because I'm much trying to be much fresh. healthier. Yep. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna get your number. I'm gonna record your deer, and then I'm out of here. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Sure. sure. Blessings. Y'all see his deer? <laughs> Y'all caught a deer before? No. <laughs> I hit about three of them. <laughs>
Especially if they're rats with big fuzzy tails. <laughs> they're a nuisance. So what do they eat? Eat grass, corn, acorns. Uh, do you set up a trap for them or no? No. Just catch them. Yeah. They don't know how to run fast? Well, they walk and then you shoot them. Hang hey, out. I'm a city girl, girl. To see this man pull up at the gym with this deer on the back of his car. He told me, I forgot I had it. I just seen some other people walk up his. I said, Y'all be catching deer. They tell me, Nah, but we be eating them. <laughs> but, uh, old Rudolph the Red Nosed Reindeer. Oh, uh, Dasher and Dancer. Well, okay, y'all. Let me get on this road. I just want to try to see what I seen. So, okay, I'll be drinking this on my way home. Beets and pineapples juice. I mean, beets, I'll be eating the beets and pineapples, and I'll be drinking the beet juice and the pineapple juice and drinking some water. All right, y'all, let's get on this journey. I think I had a good workout. I could have did better, but I could have did worse as well. I could have stayed in the bed. So I did a good job. I'll do better tomorrow. All right, y'all, it's New Year's Eve. I want to see you guys. I want to I wanna hear about you guys, I meant to say, in the comments, telling me what you cook for your family. Are you guys cooking deer? All right, guys. Yeah. Happy New Year's for me and my grandbaby. Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much 
haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up. Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts. Niggas caught me slipping, was okay, so what? Someone hit the block of my tape, it was us. Man, a house in Rose, but this shit too flush. having so much fun why are you drinking and then soon the next day baby it, it'd be terrible but right now i'm on my way to the gym um i'm gonna insert some clips i went to the gym the other day i think the man he had a whole deer on the back of his car you know i'm from the city i used to see stuff like that i'm gonna insert that then i'm gonna insert little clips of my workout but I'm back on my raw vegan diet. I'm going to do my best because I've been at my daughter's house, baby. I've been eating any and everything, baby. They, she cook every day, so I've been in there eating. I've been eating all types. I, 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 I ain't eating nothing but some salmon, fish. But I've been eating all types of cooked vegetables. So I'm going to try to do this raw vegan challenge now since it's the beginning of the year. I'm going to try to do it consistently. I wonder, can I do it? the complete 90 days because to be honest with y'all doing it it made my skin lighter it made me go to the bathroom a lot that to the point where my pool wasn't even smelling no more so it's really a lot of benefits in this but i'm on my way to planet fitness right now and then i'm gonna stop and give me a smoothie i'm gonna get a smoothie and um I'm gonna get a smoothie and I'm gonna show y'all this workout. I'm gonna show insert some clips from my last workout. I did a couple of new new workout moves. So I'm gonna insert that in there. I'm gonna I'm gonna, we're gonna go on a um it's Planet Smoothie. I don't know if they connected with um smoothie. Um I, I think they connected with Planet Fitness. So y'all let me go and put my GPS on so I won't get lost out here in these woods. When I get back home, when I get back to Chicago, 
I think I'm going to try to invest in me a personal trainer because I've been working out too long not to see no results. So I'm going to invest in me a personal trainer because they're going to push you past what you will do for yourself. So that's what I'm going to invest in, a personal trainer. And a whole lot of more stuff. Like this, this my year, I, I say this every Every year I make a New Year's resolution, but I'm the type that breaks stuff. I don't I don't see things all the way through. I could be this close to the finish line and then I drop out the race. So my goal this year is to I'ma take it one day at a one month at a time. So this my I'm instead of saying I'm gonna do the raw vegan challenge for 90 days, I'ma try to do it at least 30 consistent days. Cause when I be doing it, when I was doing it the last time, I was eating salmon with it like I was sometimes eating cooked vegetables when I tell you it made a big difference in my appearance and how I felt my energy how like I'm 48 I've been drinking damn near half my life smoking weed about how many years ago like about 10 Maybe 10, about 10 years ago just like a lot of stuff you know so I just want to try to give myself a chance I want to um get rid of all the brain fog you know when you do the raw vegan change you get rid of all the brain fog it detox it purifies the body I think it get you like you get closer to God by eating like you ain't taking all the nutrients and stuff up out the food you just make better decisions so I'm gonna do that for 30 days. I'm gonna I'm gonna go to the gym every day for 30 days. I didn't go yesterday, but I've been going every day since I've been here. I ain't go yesterday. I couldn't even get out the bed. Oh, look at this forehead, y'all. Y'all miss my forehead. <laughs> it miss y'all too. <laughs> but when I get back, me and my daughter, then we gonna try to get into something. Cause I gotta go back to Chicago in a couple days. So we gonna do something today. Um, something together so when i leave when i leave the gym i'm gonna go on head back to them and uh see what we could do but to be honest y'all my skin is way lighter from doing this raw vegan challenge doing this raw vegan diet um it, it it just it cleanses you out from all like say for instance you've been holding on to trauma from when you was a shorty when you was a little kid it detoxes your body from all the trauma and stuff you've been through. You could have been a bruise. You could be misused. You could be tossed any kind of way. You holding on to all that stuff. That stuff be in your skin. That's why when you go get them facials and stuff, you be looking different because they be trying to detox out your face. But stuff be within. Not just on the skin. It be within. So I'm going for purifying my body. I'm going to at least say... Today is day one, even though it's November, the, I mean, even though it's January the 2nd. Today is day one. Today is day one of sticking to what I said I'm going to do. And that's just, that's, that is what it is. So, um, let me pay attention again, guys. I just had to jump back on here and, um, let me know some of y'all New Year's resolutions. What y'all going to do this year? I used to smoke cigarettes like 15 years ago. And I just used to do a lot of stuff. I always, I started them trying to smoke cigarettes in high school when everybody used to be in the bathroom. I thought it was cool. Like, I just did so much that I just want to give myself a chance. Like, I deserve, oh, that going to the store right there. Um, I deserve to see what it's like to just get to know Tasha. How could I want somebody else to meet me and love me if I don't bring my full potential to the table? I want to sit back and see what's all the ins and outs on YouTube. I want to sit back and just read all the rules and regulations. I want to invest in a camera. I want to invest uh, in like a lot of stuff, like the ring uh, lights. Just a lot of stuff to help my YouTube grow. Um, I want to go home and open up this daycare, be the best daycare provider I could be. Everything I'm doing this year, I'm going to master. I'm going to be the best me I could be. I'm going to bring my, the best me to the table. I expect the best out of other people, but I don't bring the best 
out of myself. I don't bring my best foot forward. I want you to come into the relationship, friendship, whatever, uh, like with no flaws, no mistakes. So why not try to do that yourself? God is within you. You are God. You're godly. You're Jesus. He's in you. So let me carry myself like that. So, okay, guys, I'm going to pick you back up when I'm going in to get the smoothie to show you Planet Smoothie. It look, it look exactly like the sign Planet Fitness. So, I'm thinking that Planet Fitness is going to be start opening up a whole lot of Planet Smoothies. Because if you go to LA Fitness, they guess, they sell smoothies and stuff in their gym. Planet Fitness don't sell. The gyms I've been going to don't sell it. Like when I went to a private on um, Planet Fitness, they sold waters and stuff like that. It was really nice. So... I'm thinking it's got some, they probably franchising this together. So. so, okay, once again, let me pay attention. And as you can see, I'm going through all the uh, the country roads to get to Planet Fitness, and it's not scary. Francine said it could be scary at nighttime, and she ain't never told no story. It could be really scary at nighttime. You can't even see your rear view mirror. So this, is, this feels so much better. I went, uh, day before yesterday, I went in the daytime as well. So now I'm back going in the daytime. So... It is it's 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 not as bad. Okay guys. This the weird Cause when you're with me I can't explain it. It's just different. We can take it slow. I can't help but do let's get the basics. avocado oil chips. I know I thought I was be doing the raw vegan, but if I ever mess up and want a snack, I'm gonna eat these. So I have these chips, and I have the Mountain Man Crunch. Uh, Mountain Man Crunch. Okay. Emma. I'll take a medium. Oh, that's pretty vegan. Our mediums are also on sale today. So you get a dollar Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, I tried a medium. Thank you for the sip. Okay, so the Mountain Man Crunch comes with peanut butter, banana, granola, honey, and frozen yogurt. So that's what we have. Okay. A65. Thank you. Oh, I see these drinks. Everybody trying these drinks right here. Celsius? Yeah. So good. Is they? Yes. I don't like the watermelon one. I love watermelon. I probably like it. <laughs> Look how big this is, y'all. It was six dollars. It's so good. Oh, this mountain man crunch. What? Yeah, y'all. We starting fresh. We still alive. Still healthy and breathing. We starting fresh. We starting this stuff over, honey. Over me as well. So let's go. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for Tasha and her beautiful and wonderful spirit. Thank you for filling her with all the 
she needs by your blood, Jesus. And thank you for restoring her, calming her mind, and just making her whole. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 You're a stay good. <laughs> That was nice for somebody to pray over you. She prayed over this nice young man. I said, please pray over me as well. So let's get this treadmill going. All right, guys. So I just left the gym. I think I'm getting better and better. I could just walk the, up the Stairmaster 10 straight minutes. I'm doing way better than I used to. I couldn't do, do it for one minute. Let's not forget I'm 48 and great. Walked up that boy 10 minutes. And uh, it was an old man next to me. I, I showed y'all. He was on the treadmill. He had his cane hanging on, hanging on the treadmill. He walked ten minutes. I got on. I walked ten minutes too. But my my goal right now is consistency. I ain't even trying to outbeat no time. I'm not trying to beat the ten. I ain't trying to say the next time I go to the gym, I'm gonna do twenty minutes on the um stairmaster because I'm not trying to out beat myself yet i was trying to be consistent because i give up on everything so uh, i can start something and it could be almost complete and i just finished i mean just don't finish it so right now um i'm leaving the gym i murdered murdered the smoothie and now i'm finna go uh straight to this library and print out um all the papers that i had uh I, I screenshotted all the do's and the don'ts and the, how you can get paid from ads on YouTube, uh, what they don't allow you to do, what they do allow you to do. I'm just going to go uh, print those papers out instead of trying to read it off, off my phone or off the computer. I'm just going to make a folder, a YouTube folder, and just be going back and forward trying to figure out how to grow my channel. And uh, So I'm going to just go print them papers out. And then I'm going home. My daughter making shrimp tacos. But I'm not going to have the shrimp tacos today. Like I told y'all, I got here. I've been eating all type of fish, shrimp. I didn't eat no other meats. But I'm just challenging myself right now. I'm challenging myself. Um, can, can you just do at least 30 days without messing up? I'm not even worried about weight no more. Because... A man, he going to love you whether you the fattest lady in the world or if you the skinniest lady in the world. But one thing I don't want to be is a dead lady in the world. And if I if I don't change my diet, I don't go to the bathroom. So that means I'm holding all that toxic waste in and I refuse to let that be me. Um, change and generational curses start with me. Curse breakers. Changes and generational curse breakers start with me. I'm breaking every chain. Um, so, okay. I but one thing about Georgia, baby. They're going to have them a um, Waffle House, ain't they? Baby. Baby. Every corner is a Waffle House. Like in Chicago, every corner is a liquor store or a daycare. Baby, in Georgia, every corner is a Waffle House. Baby, that's so tempting. They be having them pecan waffles. Woohoo! Tap in if you eat pecan waffles. They so good. I think Waffle House, now they got the chocolate chip waffles. Girl, down here, they got some little, they got some houses down here that they turn into restaurants, gyms, and stuff like that. <coughs> it's so, <coughs> it's so homey. It's so, so lovable. Like, it's so country. But everybody look like they just got a pure heart. So sweet. I want more. I want more of that. Yeah, so y'all, I'm just trying to keep y'all in the know of what's going on. Today is January 2nd. The start of a new vlog. Uh, I didn't finish our vlog miss, all the way. I made it to 18. I tried my best. I was like seven short. I was seven. Seven vlogs short. I tried though, y'all. Going to work every day. Vlogging, editing. Man, that's a lot of work. But I tried. And I, I ain't gonna stop trying. Maybe next year I could be more prepared. You know, I know how this go. I know you need to put up a video for 25 straight days. 
<sighs> bring some good content. And I'm so happy, y'all. I'm happy to be out here with my family. <laughs> I love how my skin look now. I look cleaner, cleaner. But y'all, I'm just going, uh, I'm just, um, uh, should have chatted on and on and on and on and on. So I'm, I'm about to, uh, I'm about to hang up now. And I'll pick y'all back up when I leave the library. I'm going to the library too. I know I'm printing out that YouTube stuff, but I got to print out our papers for our vision boards. We're going to do some vision boards too for the new year. So I'll see y'all shortly. Okay, y'all, so I came home. I stopped to get magazines for the Make the Vision Boys. I came home. To, I told y'all my daughter's making shrimp tacos, so I came and made me a veggie taco, so so far I got lettuce. Oh my God, this is the boringest taco I ever had, and I got some avocado. Let's make her some crab meat. This is my, that I'm eating right now. I fried the crab meat a little bit. So I'm chopping up some avocado. I'm gonna put, uh, okay. I think I'm gonna add a little cilantro. That's to give it some taco flavor. Are you gonna make some taco meat? No, I'm gonna get a butter. Okay guys, so I'm put a little cilantro on there. Today we make a vision boys. And I think it's 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 really uh my friend in town, she said they're going to King of Danny. But I'm gonna ask my daughter, do she want to go to uh Magic City Monday? What a strip of that, baby. What a strip of that. Okay, y'all, I got me a little cilantro I'm gonna put on there. Give it some flavor, like a taco. I wish I had some cheese, but it's probably good she don't got no cheese because then that would help me mess up my diet. Can you, can you put this in Why your method on the stove is healthier? Yeah. <laughs> Tomatoes. Yeah, this is the boringest taco I ever had in my entire life. My entire existence. <coughs> Let you eat her some. Uh, you know how you dip your crab meat up in your butter? Ooh, that'd be so good. Okay, Sha, they didn't want to buy all these sauces, y'all. She didn't buy this uh, Takiri salsa. This, I, this named after them restaurants in Chicago. She bought the green salsa. She even bought some sriracha ketchup, babe. Sade is a, she Mexican, baby. Oh, tomorrow Taco Tuesday. She should have waited till tomorrow. Okay, y'all, I'm about to put some sour cream on here. Y'all give me some raw vegetable uh, recipes. So I could do this thing right. I know I could do it. I know I could do it. Okay. I think I'm, let me try this out. Oh yeah, this give it, ooh wee, yeah. This gonna make me feel like I got a taco right here. Tell me if y'all ever had this. I ain't never had this before. This tastes better than all of them. Okay, yeah, so this completes my taco. I'm gonna put a little chai seeds on there. Ugh. Okay, I put a little chai seeds on there. So I'm gonna have lunch when my daughter wake up. I guess we'll do the vision boards or we going somewhere. I told y'all we popping that sad today because I leave in a couple of days. So that completes my taco, you guys. To God be the glory. I'm going to do this uh, raw veggie diet. 
fruit diet because I have to live a long, prosperous life. I have a lot to do. I just stopped at a Goodwill and I got a, some toys for the uh, kids. So, put this back and I'll see y'all in the next part of the vlog. Hey, grandbabies. Me and my grandbabies, uh, I wanna say hey to you guys. Welcome to a new vlog. If you are new here, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Me and my grandbabies, we want to say hey to you guys and let you guys know what we're doing today. We are making vision boards. So let me bring you guys closer and show you all the good things that we have. And hopefully we can inspire someone else to make a vision board. Um, this year. We're making vision boards because we're going to keep it plain and simple and keep it in our face daily about what we want to do with this year. We're about completion this year. So whatever it is that we want to do, we're going to post it on our board and we're going to get it did. After we knock that board down, we will be making another one. I don't care if we knock it down in a month or three months. Hopefully it don't take the entire year. Okay, you guys, I just showed you all the, uh, some of the things that we'll be using to make our vision boards. So we about to get started now. Okay, y'all. Here we go. pictures up here I have Hilton Head Island Michigan Missouri North Carolina North Dakota Pioski area Michigan and then 2020 I mean start up there I have I want to be a gymnast I want to do volleyball I am going to middle school this year. Ow. <laughs> and I want to drink three smoothies each week in travel. And but I couldn't find no picture of smoothies right there, y'all. So Hello, my name is Desmond. And then today I got my vision, my vision boy. And uh, and then my, my grandma and my sister did the medical challenge. Okay, so uh Right here, I'm trying to be like all of these people or better than them uh, at what they do. I'm trying to be a better actor than them. I'm trying to be a better rapper than Drake and, and Lil Wayne and I am, and and movie stars. And then here's uh, a football picture. I'm trying to be a, uh, be good, better at football and I'm trying to do better at football. And then um, here's a, a weight thing right here. I don't know if I can see it, but here's a weight thing. Then uh, I'm trying to uh, work out more for basketball and football. So, yeah. And then um, and what, what, what I have my picture is I have, I want to make it to high school. 
for number <laughs> one. And then I. My high goals are. Then I have. I want to keep my grades up for number <laughs> two. Then I want to go places I've never been before for number three. For number four, I have I want to become a gamer. For number five, I have I want to become a YouTuber. For number six, I have I want a gaming PC. For number seven, I have I want a job. And this is my 2023 vision board. Thank you. All right, you guys. As you can see, my family is doing the 2023 mannequin challenge. And I am going to show y'all my 2023 vision board. As you can see, it's a lady working out. I said the first 30 days, I'm going to be working out at the gym every day for the first month of January. The first 30 days, I'm going to eat healthy. So this picture represents me eating healthy. Uh, for number three, uh, I'm going to be the best daycare provider I could be, not missing work, not calling off, not being late. So I got these kids up here to represent the daycare. For number four, um, if my daycare don't open back up within the 30 days of January, I'm leaving Chicago and I'm coming to Atlanta with my family. And number five, I'm going on more dates. So it's a lady and a man right here. She's new. I'm going on more fun dates. Um, and um, I have and dress to impress. So I have these people up here, RuPaul. Cardi B and a couple of other stars who dress very nice. I'm going to be dressed to impress like them. Then I want to save more money. I didn't see in the magazines any images of money. Save more money and fix my credit up. Um, I want to get all my stuff out the storages. If, and even if I have to sell them myself, I refuse to let the storage sell them or I refuse to just keep paying the storage bill. Uh, uh, I'm gonna let all my friends know and I'm gonna let uh child care know that a two-week notice if I'm leaving. Uh my number nine is do my best by my YouTube channel. I'm trying to get some uh promotions going on. I'm trying to get some do some ads, I'm trying to do um promote people hair, clothes, whatever they want me to do. And my last one is number 10 is I want to get closer to God, start reading the word, reading the Bible, reading uh, daily prayers, uh, meditating, go to church every Sunday. And this is my 2023 vision board for my next 30 days. And this is my grandkids doing American Challenge. Y'all tell me who moves. <laughs> my girl shit. Uh.